from Teenager's YouTube channel, this is Mark Josie. Today, I'll try to make this video shorter but also more exciting. Uh, today is the air gun review of this uh, M22 pistol. It's a 4.5 mm pistol, 400 FPS, hold 18 rounds inside. And uh, this is what I usually call the semi blowback. It is, it is a blowback, but you see, it doesn't go all the way. Uh, and like it's supposed to go all the way here a little bit more, but you know, it's like that. It's not a full bow black bow bow blow back. Oh, my tongue is crazy today. So, yeah, we've got a metal magazine right here, and right here is kind of like polymer or plastic, whatever. Okay, grip, and here is a metal slide. It feels like a Glock to me, okay, very Glocky. Now, let me try to show you up close if. If I can, okay. It looks really good. Uh, we'll have to do some close up. So yeah, now I'm gonna like keep talking and uh, let's get into the close up. The close up, uh, the grip, it got some very nice texture on the grip. When you touch it with the fingers, it feels pretty cool. And that the uh, stamp, the, the name, okay, the brand name, ISSC. And this is actually a replica of the uh, Rio firearm. So the uh, safety switch is fake, so it doesn't work. Uh, but the other stuff does work, and uh, I was, I am still trying to disassemble the gun. <laughs> but that uh, little thingy that you're supposed to pull down and uh, take off the slide uh, don't seem to work. So I'm not sure if I'm missing something or maybe a pin or something to punch out. But uh, so far, can't uh, disassemble the gun yet. Okay. Now the mag release, you press and the mag just spring out of there and uh, well, it's a pretty smooth action there. And uh, if you flip the gun over, you see some uh, white text there showing you the warnings and such, okay, which is pretty ugly, but it's fine. Um, yeah, so the, the trigger, uh, the trigger, there is a metal piece inside the center, which... Uh, is actually the piece that you need to hold on to in order to uh, squeeze the trigger. Uh, okay, so and there's also a uh, rail on the bottom below the uh, muscle and you can mount your light and stuff right there. Now the uh, hammer is like this is really cool. Okay, usually a Glock you, you don't see the hammer right with this model there is a hammer and the hammer is uh, actually functional. Wow. Okay, so I wonder if this hammer will work if I just uh, like don't don't rack the slide and just keep pulling the trigger. We'll try later on, okay? And also you see the uh, sight. Okay, the sight. There is a whoa. This is one of my favorite sight <laughs> because you have the blocky sight and uh, also the uh, white white paint or something on top. Okay, that makes it easier to see in the dark. So it, this is the kind of sight that I do like actually the blocky one. And then uh, at the end, we have to look at the barrel. The barrel is uh, pretty amazing. The barrel, it, it has a, 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 the big barrel, okay? It's like the, the, the fake barrel. And then inside you see a 4.5 mm barrel. The fake barrel itself is actually uh, a solid piece of metal, I believe. And then inside you see the, uh, the real barrel inside. So this means that the uh, inner barrel is not going to ra rattle and rock around and such like that. So that's pretty good. And uh, well, besides that, what else? Well, open ejection port and such like that is a plus. And we'll just uh, go back to the big screen and check out how it works. It actually comes with this tool for you to, you see, okay. So let's uh, tighten the thing up and get going. Pretty good, actually. Nice and handy. Okay, now we uh, got the target going over there. As you can see, this black man, and we're gonna stand right here. This is about uh, 16, 16 feet. Okay, or a little bit further than 16 feet, actually. Okay, let's let's hope you can get a good feel. Okay, everyone. Wow, snappy.
Look at this snappy. Okay. The slide does lock does lock back. Impressive. Uh, the, the hand right here is already vibrating from the things. Okay, so pretty good. Uh, haven't set the sight yet, but now we're gonna go check out the target. Okay, guys. So we're almost uh, hitting everywhere here, which is not very good. Uh, because all the BBs are shooting a bit low, I was trying to aim at this this point, and it's definitely not working. So I need to aim higher to about here in order to try to get this heart. Okay, so let's try the next round. Okay, guys, so we're back here with the second mag loaded up, and today we are going to uh, today right now we're going to aim higher. Okay, let's see. Okay, aim higher. Higher. Let's say. Okay, I'll cover the the center with it with the sight. Well, I really do have to aim very high. Now this time we got a lot of targets, a lot of holes in the center already. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, a lot of holes right here, two holes right here, and I am mostly trying to cover this with the whole sight. Okay, so you can see the sight is definitely shooting too high. A lot of things went to the left too. That might be my problem. So if uh, everything goes well. I will shoot a little bit higher and then we should be able to uh, punch out the whole center. Okay guys, so now let's go with the third mag right here, okay? And I changed the angle a little bit so we can see the gun a little bit better. Aiming higher and also uh, trying to shoot more uh, to the center, okay? Let's go. That was fast. I'm I'm trying to grip the gun harder, uh, like not really squeeze, but more forward. Uh, and I feel the kick is actually going to my shoulder, right here already. <laughs> so the kick is very nice. It vibrates you. And uh, let's get over there and see how it does. Okay, guys. So with more uh, a bit of flyers right here. Okay, one shot right here. Mostly we're covering this nine and ten mostly around here nothing in the eight nothing on the seven so i'm definitely getting the the the, the feel of this gun and most of the shot is all here so if i continue this pattern maybe uh let's say in one or two mags you'll see this thing all punched out okay guys we're on the fourth magazine and let's see how it goes wow you hear the sound like that Amazing. Okay, so let's get going. Fourth mag. Still going on rapid shooting because this is a action pistol. So trying to shoot faster and uh, feel the blowback. Okay, so more to the center, higher. Let's go. Okay, I feel the blowback is getting weaker uh, right now on the fourth mag, but it's still locking back on the last round. Okay, the CO2 is not freezing, but it is cold. And you can definitely uh, say that uh, the gun is very efficient in terms of how it used the CO2. Even on the fourth mag, full mag is doing really good. Okay, nice and efficient. Reminds me of the Makarov Ultra. Now let's get over and check it out. Now very obviously right here you see a lot more holes in the center and you can put the hand inside already. So I can say we are successful with uh, our, our aiming. Okay, it's mostly here and uh, not much shots all around so I'm good. Uh, if this is like a real gun, it's uh, shooting pretty well. Okay, 
now let's load up the last mag and continue. Hey guys, this is the fifth magazine. Okay, let's see how it does. Let's go. Now, I should say this gun is very, very uh, efficient with the gas, the CO2. Even on the uh, fifth magazine, it, uh, it's still doing fine. Let's go. Wow, snappy. The snap came back. Holy. Okay, we destroyed the center for sure. This is really cool. Okay, it's still going strong on the fifth mag, and this is insane. <laughs> Let's load up one more mag and uh, keep shooting. Mag number six. And it's still working to lock back the slide on the last round. Amazing. Let's go. Mag number six. Oh, you see, it go brah, brah, okay? But you see, it doesn't need to uh, need the hammer to pull back. When you just go like this and press the trigger, it will still shoot. You see? It's still shooting. And then we're done. No more. So, six magazines. So we're done shooting, uh, unload the mag, and that's it for today. So thanks for watching, and remember to subscribe, like, share, comment below. If you'd like to see more guns video from me, remember to give it a like, okay? And we'll be doing more guns video later on. Now, again, uh, this gun is from one of my friends uh, in Quebec, Vincent. So thanks him again for the gun. It's a really uh, cool gun to shoot. Uh, I will say that it's not the most accurate pistol, but it is actually quite fun to shoot. Especially the blowback, it really kick right this, right here. Okay, and you can, if you hold it, grip it harder, you can feel that on the shoulder too. Really amazing. So, uh, there we go. Guns review again. <laughs> See you next time. Bye-bye. Okay guys, so here goes the trap at the end just to let you see the holes up close and also how the stuff behind looks like. You see, this is duck seal and this is actually my first shooting session with this trap. Whoa. Okay, so you can see that uh, it, all the BBs got in here and you got to like pick them out or something. But yeah. Not very well. Clean. Very clean. Okay. So, that's it. See ya.